Hey, this is Guido from Wacom and in this video I will explain the Wacom display settings. This is a small tiny utility you use when you want to control the brightness, the contrast and the color temperature of your Wacom One. So the easiest way to access the display settings is by using the Wacom Desktop Center. Let's open it here on the screen and here you see my Wacom One 13 inch and on the right side I can see my display settings. The display settings are talking now to my Wacom One and reading out the settings. And what you can see here is, let me close that one for you. Um, it recognizes my Wacom One 13 inch display. It gives the actual brightness value, which is at a full 100% here. And my contrast is set to 50%. And I can use now the sliders to adjust the settings to the values I really prefer and what's for me most um, comfortable to watch. So I leave it now with brightness 100, contrast 50 and spend a little bit more talking on about the color temperature. So this is um, the preset is a color temperature of 6500 Kelvin. What does it mean? Let me show you a chart which I have here on my screen. So 6500 Kelvin is the color temperature of a cloudy sky in real life. So quite bluish from color and if I don't like this specific color temperature I can easily change it to a different one. The Wacom One offers you different values for color temperatures 5000, 6500, 7500 and 9300 Kelvin. And the lower than the Kelvin rate is, in this case 5000 Kelvin, the warmer will be my screen image. It's quite hard to recognize on the screen recording, but uh, my screen has now turned a bit more yellowish. So as you could see, 5000 is something between moonlight and midday sun, where as again, 6500 is an overcasted sky. And if I don't like this warmer color temperature, I can easily go to 7500, which is even more bluish then, and it can go up high on 9300 which is a clear blue sky at midday. So easy to remember the lower the number of Kelvin color temperature is the warmer will be my image on the screen. I go back to 6500 Kelvin which is possibly the most frequently used one in imaging and yeah if I have done all my settings here I click on the save button and I can quit my color settings and it will be stored in the Wacom One unit. Thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful. Take care.